five person committee. Um, I would like to propose, oh, I didn't really know how you all wanted us to handle it, but the way that we all had kind of talked about it is every time that there is a request for disbursement of the funds that our committee would need to either approve or deny the funds. If it's less than $500, I would like permission for my committee and I to just approve or deny. If approved, we turn it to the city clerk to be paid. Any amount over $500, we bring to the city council to be approved. I feel like that would kind of cut down on council meeting time. I don't know that you'll get very many for just $500. Right, I understand, but we have we only have one request now, and it's less than $500. It's a small request, so I thought that small ones like that would be easier if our committee just approve or deny and then submit them for payment. Can they do that? Do it Would we still be notified when there's money spent or we can get a report saying this was approved or this or whatever? Yes. I mean, we'll still know about it. I mean. Right. Well, she said they'd have to turn it in to the clerk for payment. But the only problem is, is what she was just telling me is that there's... Um, They've already approved almost all the money that we'll be receiving into that account this year. Hopefully, we're going to make it within that $2,000 range. So, I'm sorry, they We've already approved all the money out. Well, we needed to know that ahead of time. We've asked, we, yes. we have asked for amounts of these accounts, and we have not been given that information. So I would like to be given that information. Well, you know, you've got to do your job. You know, right. you got to know what the information is. Right. If they're responsible to give us a, a duty time. and yeah. then not give us the information that we need. Well, I agree. So you gave something yes, I have. to I've Moses. Given everything to Moses Porterfield, and I'll be more than happy to send to you the information he has received. And he okay. he's asked for clarification. Also, thank you. He has not got it. Well, that so, I'm not aware of. But anyway, something. but anyway, my question now is: any amounts under five hundred dollars, is it okay if we go ahead and approve? I'm being told by one of the committee members that that's how other cities do it. I don't have any cities to name yeah. um, that do that. Um, Terry's deciphering. Well, I'm, I'm just uh, let, let me get back to this. Back because I've got a, there's a problem with the, uh, us using or you know, really assigning the power of the city to somebody that's not a city, that's not part of the city, paying out. So let me let me get back with you. Okay, I just would appreciate some clarification. Sure. What was the other questions you had? That was it. I just wanted, had a more. Uh, well, we, we do have a request for disbursement, and I'll go ahead and cover that now since we don't have a clarification. Um, the city has previously always, I don't know, always, but um, placed an ad in showing Missouri Magazine promoting waterfowl tourism in the city. It's a 1 16 page ad. It's a $500 advertisement that has been invoiced that I would like to request that we go ahead and get paid out of the tourism tax. I think we have the money. Everything that we will be receiving throughout the year has already been spoken for. Spoken for. I'm sorry. We can do it, but then we might possibly not have the money to meet what we've already allowed out. We so, have CAFTA and the air, show. air shows. I mean, we've got a list a mile long. So why do we ask the chamber to take all this over if there's no money for them to give out or deny? Well, that was not my question. That was not my decision. I'm sorry. I don't think they were aware of how much it's spoken for. That really not very them. Well, the chamber's job is to promote tourism. But we so. spend it all and ask them to take care of it. Well, I think that might have been a boo-boo. <laughs> well, I mean... Yeah. So we, so we've committed. To, it sounds like the money for this year. So but but that doesn't negate that the fact the, that we have an outside source evaluate the requests for the future. And the money flows in on a revolving monthly rate. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. So it's not a set. We receive fifty thousand. We spent fifty thousand. I understand that if you expend all that right now, if you overstep that whole amount of money, that later on down the line is going to be over. But I don't think it's going to. This is going to put you in the red. There's a good possibility it could. We do not receive a lot of revenues within our tourism tax. We pay the chamber approximately $2,800 a month now. 
We just wrote CAFTA almost a $5,000 check because we allotted them $7,500 back at the beginning of the summertime for their fall into the arts. Um, there's been several expenditures. We receive approximately $3,000 some odd dollars a month in that account from our different motel hotels within the city of Kennett. So, if we only get in X amount and it's already been spoken for, I mean, some of the revenues are down. Tourism is more low. <coughs> Let's do this. Sake of argument. I've got $3,000 in expenditures in, my, in the mayor's account. Uh, will the council make a motion to, to fund this with that expenditure? Motion. Not, we have a motion. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Some of that money's been allotted to Randy for the spraying and stuff. He's been spending that money for the chemical spraying around town. But not $3,000. I can't tell you how much it is, James. It's I mean, we spent some money. I, I can't tell you how much it is off the top of my head. Mm -hmm. We'll find 500 bucks. Is there a motion to find $500? To motion. To fund this? Second. Motion to second. Any discussion regarding this? I feel like we put them on the spot doing this. I, I would like to get this off our backs, and then we can re-clarify whatever questions we may have and get update financial conditions. It's, let me get a vote real quick first, please, though. It's, uh, all in favor say aye. Aye. Uh -huh. All opposed? The motion passes. <laughs> Take care of this one. Let's, to be fair, let's get, let's get, let's just have a sit down. Yes, let's do it. And we get everything all ironed out. All right. And please have Moses call me because I have given him all the information he's requested. Okay. I don't understand what that's about. I mean, I spent three hours up here one evening getting every bit of the finances that I possibly could have given to him. And after this duty's been assigned to me, I spent several hours getting applications together, getting people to be on a committee for money that I don't have. So I spent a lot of time on it, too. Well, we'll get it. We'll get it. We'll work on it. Okay. Right. Okay. 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 Thank you. Thank you very much. Anything else? Yeah. Anything else? Well, uh, being adjourned.